This is a Kingston A400 SSD. Let's look at the detailed model. Here records a clear model of PS3111. In fact, this is the real controller ID. PS3111 SSDs of Kingston product series usually can get ready status when encountering malfunction. If it cannot get ready, we can refer to AS2258 PS3111 tutorial for reference. A PS3111 SSD with ready status often behaves with common failing. Especially when there is translator malfunction. ID typically displays code of certain type. Now we connect it to MRT and view the actual behavior. We specially added Kingston 2 PS3111 module for this model. Select and enter the utility, wait for the initialization to complete. The process may take a while depending on the SSD status. Note, the key to creating virtual translator is to ensure the success of the last two items. The stop button display will become gray, indicating the end of initialization. Click on Create Translator. After the virtual translator is created, we return to the main interface. Enter DE module to create a data copy task. In the settings, choose factory reading mode on command to read page. Disable soft reset in error handling and timeout settings. Because some SSDs may encounter delayed feedback, leading to long busy issue. It is recommended to skip 8 sectors for read error skipping. Go to File Explorer to check if the file tree can be accessed. You can then start the imaging process. If file tree cannot be expanded, it is recommended to choose VHDX as target device. Then use tools like RSTUDIO to scan files.